Well, this is going to be my first sort of mid-range bike ride of the year. Uh, like I say, I've had the hernia, so I've only really... The most miles I've done this year is 40 miles in one go, so I want to head up to the Falkirk Wheel from Bannockburn. I've just came up this way. Here's the crossroads, and then this is, takes you to the Auchindowie Caravan Park. I think that's actually a way now. Uh, I think it's shut down. And then across to the Forsyth Garage Road, and I'll go through Denny, uh, and then onto the canal, and then I'll fall from the canal to the Falkirk Wheel. There's my new saddlebags. I did have the ones that you clipped onto the side, but I thought they were a bit big, so I got one of these bags that the saddlebags uh, uh, unfold down. Makes it a little better, so I've not got a bag on my shoulders, takes the weight off as well. He's rocking Bowie Caravan Park. This has been here for years since I was a boy. But you see, shut down. People can't afford to to keep the upkeeps and stuff. It's a shame, mate. So onward. So that's we just came off the main road here, and as you see, there's the bike there on the canal bridge. That way there is the one that we usually go. You've probably seen videos me, Graf and John have went that way, so I will be heading that way and it's going to be pretty good because that's a new road, I've never been that way but I know where it ends up, it ends up at the Falkirk Wheel and then the canal takes you all the way to the Kelpies but there we are, I've did 10 miles in about just over an hour uh, I don't know how, how many miles it is to the Falkirk Wheel but there was a nice lady there with a snack van and so I treated myself to a can of cola and a millionaire shortbread, so I'll have them. Maybe a wee bit down there, watch the swans or some wildlife or something, so... The sun's just coming out as well there, so that's pretty good. I'll head a couple of more miles and have some of this. Lovely. So this is my own my way at the Falkirk Wheel, and I was just thinking, I actually have been on this road before, me and John, but we came the opposite way. Uh, the year, last year, maybe two, two years ago, we... We went uh, from the Falkirk Wheel all the way through to Mary Hill, uh, so that was a good run. So uh, I've actually have been on this road, just know this direction. Now we need a short bread, can of cola. The Falkirk Wheel. Leaving the fuck wheel behind now. We're off to the sea, the Kelpies. The pathways along here are just brown, they're all tar, they're fermented. Really, really good. Very scenic area, too. That was a wee short ride, it was only about two miles to here and this is the beef eater, or it used to be the beef eater, I don't know what it's called now, but it's pretty good. I was a bit worried about crossing this road, but there's a bridge underneath, so that's pretty good. So I just came from that way, but the, the canal path seems to have disappeared a wee bit. Hopefully I'll get back on the road up here. But. This building here used to be a garage and when I was uh, a YTS when I was 16 I actually worked there but look at it now, it's a furniture shop and there's a restaurant just there The cars used to be all along the, the canal bank and you know, the new cars that you could buy But onward I'm not going to get in the day, I was there last week, so... It's a busy day So I'm heading that way. So I've just came from that way. There's some nice wee cycle path running about the Kelpies there. Until you get to a wee bit here, you've actually... I think that's a cycle path, but you're actually on the pavement. 
uh, with pedestrians and then you go across here to the big roundabout, nip across there, then through Skin Flats, I think we head onto the National Cycle Network again and from here to the motorway bridge near Kincardine where I filmed a couple of weeks ago, that's four miles from here to there so I'll show you the, end of the cycle route here so I'll need to cross the road and then we're on a cycle path on that side. This is all uh, changed here, it's all, uh, it's all traffic lights and multi-lane. Big changes from the way here, this was not here last time I was up. Ah, peace, perfect peace again. Off the main road, back on our cycle path, cycle network. And you see car on Granite Power Station away there in the distance. Here's the road. And this will take me to the bridge across the motorway. I just came from that way, that was the four miler. And as you see the sign here, I'll just zoom in, it says round the fourth, Stirling 14 mile. So I've just checked my map my ride and I went, so far I've went nearly 25 mile and then it's 14 mile back to Bannerburn. You see, there's the bike, right. I've got across the bridge again, down here, along there, along there, back to Kerry. So, it's been pretty good so far, uh, legs are okay, uh, a wee bit sore in the, in the hernia wound bit, but no too much, I think it's just aches and pains really, because I've never done this amount of miles for a wee while. Uh, it's been really really good, it's been very warm, uh, little winds, there was a wee bit of rain at the beginning, but it was just spitting a wee bit, uh, but legs feel good so far, and uh, yeah, very enjoyable, I'm quite happy. So I'm on the Cowie back roads here. I just love some of the red car and the haystacks. Plays a bit of colour. So I'm nearly at Cowie and then about another mile and a half to Bannockburn. Uh, legs are getting a wee bit sore now. Uh, I know as much as I thought would, surprisingly, but I've been taking it really easy. Eh? I've not been uh, pushing it. So, uh, well, yeah, very enjoyable. That's me back to the beginning. Just came this way through Kiwi. And as you can see, I've had nearly 34 miles. 4 hours, 17 minutes. I'm happy with that.